like exploratory factor analysis, confirmatory factor analysis, and structure equational modeling. So after this, what will come that how many factors are valid to represent truthfully one particular variable so after this a model will come maybe you know up till now against one variable we had around seven to eight factors or items so now after validity analysis we might have only two to three left or all right i can say you know there will be some sort of a reduction also so and only the valid factors will be taken for the specialized test so uh, as i said i will not go much into the detail of this and uh, all you can do is again just go to youtube and write scm series and in this way you can have pretty much precise information about how to conduct this particular test so or i can say these particular tests so and this will be pretty much uh, because i I, uh, I saw all these videos and uh, i will not say all these videos but most of the videos and uh, then uh, i found it pretty much easy to understand and it is um, what you can say uh, even a normal person with not having much knowledge can easily understand those videos so one last time I would say for a validity test an exploratory factor analysis confirmatory factor analysis and structure equational modeling should be applied and then we will have reliable out outcomes prepared and screened outcomes the representative profile of the respondents descriptive statistics done and uh, then the valid factors against each variable and the valid model to to be tested and finally we have the specialized test to check the support or rejection of research hypothesis so in this case uh, i will go deep deep deep, 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 deep. so somewhere there the test of hypothesis okay uh, this section includes estimation of the path coefficient and r square values in particular to measure the effect of mediation in research model the researcher subsequently assessed all study hypotheses so in simple words but i will say that uh, once you are done with the validity and all other tests so all you need to do is to apply a specialized test for example if there is one independent variable or one dependent variable the specialized test might be standard linear regression so if there are if there are more independent variables we can apply the multiple regression technique so and uh, for a mediation we have specialized technique that is used what we have known as uh, the sobel test by using this formula and we have triangulated this test with the most least 